it. Happy Friday. It's the last day of the week. So that means that we got through our first virtual um, school week. So I hope that you guys learned a lot from your teachers this week. I hope that you guys had fun and I hope that you enjoyed my videos that I posted up for you um, for Spanish and art on my YouTube channel. So since today is Friday, it's that means that we're going to be uh, having a art video today. What we're going to do is a how to videos. So on Fridays, I'm going to do how to videos and I'm going to be showing you or posting a video where we're going to learn how to draw something together. So Friday, what we're going to do is make how to videos. So we're either going to draw it together or I am going to teach it to you. But if you have any ideas on something that you would want us to do the video on, you can send it to me on the comments or you can email it to me and I am going to put a little piece of paper into this container and on Friday, I'm going to pull one out and that is going to be the topic that we're going to do for this video. So today, what we're actually going to have is how to draw Baby Yoda. So if you don't know who Baby Yoda is, then I'm going to put a picture up here for you. But if you do, then you know that it's an adorable character. And this is my drawing of Baby Yoda. So what we're going to do is we are going to draw Baby Yoda together and watch an incredible video of someone who's going to teach us step by step on how to create this beautiful character. And I'm going to follow along with you guys. If you need to pause your video because they're going too fast, then you can pause it and continue when you are ready. So actually what I'm doing, is, or what I did for my drawing, um, that is different from the person we're gonna watch drawing it, is I actually used pencil first. So you might wanna use pencil first just because sometimes you make mistakes and mistakes are okay, but that way we can erase and we don't have to um, crumble up our paper and throw it away. We could just erase it, okay? So let's start and figure out how to draw Baby Yoda together. We hope you're gonna follow along with us. What do they need for this lesson? <laughs> Markers, something to draw with, some paper, and something to color with. <laughs> let's get started. <laughs> we're first gonna draw a V shape in the middle of our paper. So we're just gonna go down a little bit and then come back up. This is his collar. Yeah, and we're gonna draw his head. We're gonna start inside of the V and we're gonna draw a big upside down U shape. Yeah. All right, now we're gonna draw his eyes. We're gonna draw a big circle and I'm gonna come down and touch the bottom of the V or touch the V at the bottom of the circle and I'll draw the same size circle over here on the right side. I'm drawing them really big, big baby eyes. Okay, then we're gonna, we're gonna draw a smaller circle inside. This is for the highlight to make his eyes look shiny. Then let's color in his eyes. We're gonna color in the big circle, but leave the little circle white. Next, we're gonna draw his nose. And he's got a really small nose. So we're gonna draw a little curve in between his eyes, close to the bottom of the V. Then we're gonna draw the top of his nose. We'll draw an upside down U to complete the shape of his nose. All right, now let's draw his ears. We're gonna start over here and we're gonna draw a big line that comes out to the side. Yeah, and then we can curve up just a little bit right at the end. Then we're gonna come back down and connect to this line on the side. Yeah, now let's repeat that same step over here on the left side. We're gonna draw another diagonal line that comes out and we want it to be the same length. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. And then right at the end, you kind of already curved up. I'm gonna do that same thing. And then we're gonna curve back down and connect to that line. His ears are so big. I know, he's already looking really cute. <laughs> now we're gonna draw the inside of his ear. We're gonna draw another line. We'll start out here on the, on the tip of his ear. We'll come back into his head. And look, I get further away towards his head. So it's thicker here and thinner out here. Yeah, and then right at the end, we'll curve down into his head. Now let's do the same thing on the other side. Draw a line that comes in and gets thicker. Yes, and then right at the end, curve down. We did it. All right, now at the top of his head, let's draw little hairs. 
sticking up little baby hairs. Even though he's 50 years old, he, <laughs> he looks like a baby. Now let's draw his clothes. We'll start over here on his ear and we're gonna draw a diagonal line that comes down and we can do the same thing on the other side his little robe that he was wearing, and then another line over here on this side. His little robe that he was wearing was kind of up close to his eyes. <laughs> yeah, I drew mine a little longer. There you go. And then over here on this side, we're gonna draw another diagonal line that comes across. And then instead of connecting, we're gonna first curve up to the top. And then over here, we'll curve back down and connect to the middle. All right, now we're ready to draw his arms. We're just gonna draw a little, uh, another short diagonal line. It comes out on both sides. <laughs> and this little guy is way too cute. And then we're gonna draw the bottom of his sleeve. So we'll draw another diagonal line that comes in. It looks like a sideways V. And we'll do the same thing on, on this side. Yeah, now we're gonna draw a little line up. Don't go all the way up to the top. Just stop short, and then we'll do the same thing over here. There's his little sleeves. All right, now on the end of his sleeves, they're rolled up. So let's draw a shape that comes out of the side, comes down, across, back up, and then connect in. A little tricky. If you guys need more time, remember you can always pause the video. Oh, this yeah. got kind of big. No, that's good. Oh, no. no, it's good. I like it. No, it's perfect. It's okay that they're different, right? Okay. The most important thing is? To have fun. And? Practice. Practice. And I'm glad that you drew the oh. same on the other side so that they look like they match. Yeah, they're extra large. Extra big. That's okay. okay. Right. <laughs> now let's draw his hand. We're going to draw a little baby hand that's just coming out of his sleeve. So we're going to draw a little curve. And then we're going to draw a line that connects up to the sleeve. Then on the other side, we're going to draw his thumb. Yoda only has, or baby Yoda only has three fingers, like grown-up Yoda. But I think a lot of people are saying this isn't actually Yoda. He's just a baby version of the same type of species. Maybe it's his cousin. It could be. Uh, or it's Yoda's baby. Oh. And then <laughs> we'll draw a line that connects up. Okay, and then we'll draw another curve that comes in. Wait, okay, now on the end of each of these little fingers, let's draw an upside down U for his fingernail. We'll do the same thing over there on the other side. Or his claw. Next, we're gonna draw the bottom of his robe. We'll start over here by his thumb and we'll come down. I'm just gonna draw a little S line. We could do the same thing on the other side too. And you can't see his feet because they're, his robe is so long. And then we're gonna connect we're going to draw a little curve that connects over to the other side. Now right here, I'm going to draw another little wrinkle. I like that you have this little line right there. It looks like a wrinkle. And I'm going to add that same thing over here on this side too. I'm going to add another one over here. Look like little wrinkles. Good job. And we can also add one over here on his other arm. All right, Mrs. Hubs, we did it. We finished drawing baby Yoda. He looks really cute, except he's gonna look even cuter once we do what? Color. Yeah, we need to color him. This part we're gonna fast forward, but at the end, you guys can pause the video to match the same coloring. You ready to fast forward? Yes. All right, Mrs. Hubs, we did it. We colored baby Yoda. He looks so much cuter, all colored in. Did you have fun? I did. <laughs> now you guys can pause the video right now to match the same coloring. I also added highlights and shading to make them look more 3D, but you can leave that off to keep the lesson a little easier. I especially love your drawing, Mrs. Hubs. Thanks. We hope you had fun drawing Baby Yoda with us. Yeah, we do. We hope you had a lot of fun, and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. That was an awesome video. Here is a closer look of my Baby Yoda. As you can see, I am outlining the Baby Yoda with a black marker because I used pencil first and his clothes is orange and not brown because I did not have brown, but that is a-okay. You can adjust your colors differently if you do not have certain colors. So this is my Baby Yoda after following the instructions on 
the video and this is my baby Yoda with some background so I added some grass I added a building in the back and the sky and some clouds I kept it really simple but if you want to add a background you can if you do not want to and you want to leave it white in the back then that is fine but I hope to see some of your pictures of your baby Yoda please email them to me if you would like to share them with me you do not have to email them to me if you do not if you don't want to but I would love to see them so I hope that you guys have a fantastic weekend and I will see you on Monday bye